Hello, hello, welcome to my channel. I am Stephanie and this is day 24 of Veda video every day in April. And here are some authors that I would love to meet. I said these are some authors that I would just love and just like completely fangirl over. I have been going to author events and signings and conventions and things like that since 2016 so I've met quite a few authors but here are some unicorn authors that I would just like flip the hell out if I was to actually get to meet them. Um, their books are just amazing to me. I love them and I would just love to meet them. So my first one I'm going to talk about is is Jodi Ellen Malpas. She is the author of the This Man series of the Controversial Princess Smoke and Mirrors series that I have read and I absolutely adore her. I mean her writing is dirty and it's gritty and it's different. Um, it's dark and I love it. I love every single minute of it and if I was to actually get to meet her, which if I'm not mistaken, she's supposedly going to be at a Polycon 2020. So I am going to be fighting to get my tickets uh, to go once again, because yes, yes. Um, and if I get to meet her, I might have to like, get myself together and be like, <sighs> yes, because Whew. And I follow her on Instagram and her Instagram pictures are, mwah, she's gorgeous, she's just gorgeous. Oh my God, I, did, I don't know what I'm going to do with myself, but she is definitely a unicorn author for me to meet. The next author I'm going to talk about is E.L. James, and I have quite a few author friends that are like friends with her, and oh my God. I would love to meet her. I am completely obsessed with everything Fifty Shades of Grey and that trilogy. I'm looking forward to reading her new book, which will probably have been done, hopefully, by the time this airs or is released on the channel, or I might be into it already. Never know. Um, but I'm looking forward to that new book, and I'm looking... F I wish I could have gone to, like, New Jersey, New York, or... I think there was one other place that was sort of close by but not close enough for me to travel up on a weekday to try and go meet her and get tickets and stuff like that. Ugh, I so wish I could have because I'm quite jelly over all of all the people that got to go and seeing their Instagram pictures with her. I'm just like, ah, I wish I could have fangirled with you. The next author I'm going to talk about is Christy Pastore, and she is in the Midwest, and Christy and I have a very, very sweet and fun relationship, uh, author-reader relationship, because Christy likes to give me contemporary that's very different and twisted up differently. I love her Facebook page where she does her either ors and she is completely obsessed with the royals and fashion and everything like that and I just love that she used to be in the blogger world in the fashion world and she is giving it to us like hardcore and I am stalking her like in a good way to try and meet her someday because she's amazing and I would just love to meet her and then finally I'm going to talk about Fabiola Francisco, who rocked my world with one book that put me in an author slump. I mean, how often can you say that you're in an author slump for a complete author? No matter what works they give you, they put you in a slump after you read one of their books. Yes, she did this for me for an entire year. I want to say it was from 2017 to 2018 that I could not physically pick up another book after I read Red Lights, Black Hearts. She destroyed me with that book. And then I was like, I want to support. I just don't know if I can pick it up another one because you emotionally wrecked me. Fabiola. Fabi. Uh, well, Fabiola has now moved to Italy 
which is beautiful and I love watching her Instagram pictures of all the amazing places that she's going and uh, seeing and experiencing things like that but if she ever comes back to the United States to do some signings I will be trying to find her and uh, get her to sign my books although I have signed books or I'm getting signed books from her so it would just be to meet her just so I can hug her and be like oh you're you're the greatest you're the best you're so sweet I love it and I love the interaction she she's very personable and I love that I love when an author is personable to their readers and you know that's amazing I love it. So who are some of your unicorn authors that you would just love and fangirl and die to meet? Let me know down in the comment section. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, there is a feedback form down in the description box so you guys can help me improve my channel. Thank you for watching and we will see you guys tomorrow.